Madison Square Garden, New York City, January 6, 1928. In the ring, Joe Humphreys introducing the challenger for the light heavyweight championship of the world, Leo Lomsky. And coming out of the corner from the left, the light heavyweight champion, Tommy Lagren. Lagren the champion, Lomsky the challenger. Lagren weighing 174 and a half, Lomsky 171. The referee is Jack Denning. A huge crowd at Madison Square Garden. Leo Lomsky, the shorter of the two, out of Aberdeen, Washington. They call him the Aberdeen Assassin. Tommy Lagren, the stylist. Defending his champion in the scheduled 15 rounder. Lagren is managed by Joe Smith. Lomsky by Eddie Baker. Down he goes. Tommy Logwin is down. A solid right hand. He's taking the count. The championship at stake. Leo Lomsky waiting. Now he comes after the champion again. Just the opening minute of the first round. Tommy Logwin trying to keep Leo Lomsky off and Lomsky swarming all over him. There's plenty of time left in this first round. Tommy Logren in trouble here at the opening of the scheduled 15 rounder. Leo Lomsky has won 20 fights in succession. Logren seems to have recovered somewhat now. Still fighting carefully against Lomsky. Lomsky a murderous puncher. Logren trying to keep Lomsky off of that left jab. Leo Lomsky trying to finish right here and now. Down he goes again. The champion is down. Referee Denning picks up the count. But Lagren is up on his feet again. Only moments ago before the end of this first round. Tommy Lagren has been knocked down twice with solid right hand punches. And that's the end of the first round. But it's a different story from here on in. Right through the fight, Lagren came on. Came on fast during the rounds, taking full command, though Lomsky fought furiously, relentlessly. Lagren opened a cut over Lomsky's left eye in the eighth round. It bled freely and handicapped Lomsky during the remainder of the fight. In the ninth round, the patch was fixed over Lomsky's left eye, but it was a target for Lagren's left jab. And he knocked it off, the blood flowing. Lagren is fully recovered from that first round series of knockdowns. Lomsky still coming on, but Lagren has the situation pretty well in hand right now. The judges are Charlie Matheson and Tommy Flynn. And on their scorecards right now, Tommy Lagren is well ahead. Lomsky must KO Lagren if he is to win the light heavyweight championship of the world. And he almost came through with that KO in the very first round. As you see, Tommy Lagren is beating Leo Lomsky to the punch, outboxing him, dancing away using his superior height and reach. This is one of the great comebacks in the history of the ring, with the champion down twice in the first round, coming on strongly.
Lagren still dancing out of range, still using that left jab effectively. Lomsky has not been able to score well since the second round. Tommy Lagren cuffing Leo Lomsky with those good right hands. A boxing master in operation, Tommy Lagren. Lomsky still trying. Still throwing punches all the way, and that's the end of the fight. And a unanimous decision is announced in favor of the champion of the world, Tommy Lagren. Thank you.